to part two of my U.S. camp experience. U.S. camp experience, not just the U.S. experience, the camp one. And I'm going to talk about the experience that happened to me. <laughs> Yo, I'm even in my feelings right now, about to talk about it. Just thinking about it, I'm in my feelings. So one of the days, we were playing this <clears throat> so i told you earlier that we had teams right basically what happened was they said that we are doing this thing called capture the flag mind you i don't know why i don't know this game they're supposed to capture the flag supposed to capture the flag <laughs> capture the flag of the other team and that's my first time playing it for real for real so here's what happened so on the day that we new capture the flag we started a game Ping, blah 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 everyone's running around not trying to get tagged by an enemy because if you get tagged by an enemy you have to get untagged by like someone who's on your team anyways yeah so what happened was um i was running doing my thing running trying to tag people and getting tagged and untagged by my friends and then i saw this girl she was chasing me so me <laughs> as an african if someone chases you you don't just stand there you run 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 and I was running before I knew it. I heard, Grrr. guess what the sound was? It was my ankle scraping on the floor. I twisted my ankle. I actually wasn't sure whether I sprained my ankle. It was just painful. But before, I actually didn't feel the pain. I just felt my leg dragging on the floor. I was like, oh, it's nothing. So I tried to get up. Hey. I never expected it. <laughs> I never expected it. I don't feel anything. <laughs> Where is my ankle? Why am I not feeling my ankle? Yeah, apparently they said I had sprained my ankle and it was kind of hurting. <laughs> but you know me, you know me. High pain tolerance girl right here, baby. So I was like, oh girl, you don't know me. Let me get up, let me get up real quick. Move, 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 move. Okay. And I got up, I was like, ow. Wow. This is actually hurting me. I could not put my leg on the ground. Like when I put it on the ground and I try to walk with it, it's so painful, but I was able to manage. So when I sat down, I was like, ah, Karis, so are you really going to sit down here and let the sprain uncle stop you from enjoying? I can't be sitting here. Like, why? 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 So I was able to get up and then the pain subsided because it wasn't it wasn't that deep, right? The pain it wasn't that deep. Then I started playing the game again, but this time I'm not run. I was not running like before because it was low-key hurting me. I was trying to do tough girl, tough girl, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm built different. And then, one of the counselors, so she came, she was like, oh, Karis, what happened to the leg? You know what I said? I was like, girl, I sprained my ankle while I was running. And I was running from this person. They they were part of endurance. And she was like, but they're on your team. <laughs> the person I was running from was on my team. Hey. And I looked so stupid. I was looking dumb. Because I thought that this person was the enemy, they were my friend. <laughs> I just sprayed my uncle for nothing. Pains. Pains. P. Double T. Pains. Are you serious? So like, let me rest my uncle later to take me to next. So I sat down. So the capture the flag game ended. And then went to the, the auditorium before. Yeah. We went to the, at the time my leg was fine. Like it was hurting me small, small, but it's not that deep, right? Like an hour after we finished, or like 30 or 45 minutes after I sprained my ankle. So I was fine. So like, ah, this ankle crack, it can move. I can still run. So then we went to the auditorium. They said we should catch the counselors. From wherever they are hiding, the counselors are hiding on the camp. We just find them from the camp. And then I was, you know, remember when I told you about the river in the middle of the camp? So I was supposed to either push the counselors inside the river for them to get wet. Or find water and pour it on them for, for them to get soaked. Good. We went outside. I was with some people, right? We are looking for counselors, I've been. And then we saw this this human being in a tree. I remember this guy, his name was Hercules. We were like, get down, we can't climb, just get down. We've caught you already. So he got down from the tree. And guess what he did? He ran. Hey, we chased him. With my uncle that was already here, so we chased him. I started running, I started running. And then we caught him. And then he ran again. And I was chasing him again with the other people. We were chasing him. All of a sudden, boom, 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 boom. I fell. I fell down again. 
a fucking game. Nothing new. Sprain my ankle all over again. Now this time it hurts more than the first time. I can't do this anymore because my leg started looking weird. It was very painful. I could not walk. And that's what it ended up in tears. I don't remember how I even got to the nurse's place. Oh yeah, and you remember the Sarah guy I told you about? We also became very close friends. So we were also hanging out. So she was the one who took me to the nurse. So the first day I sprained my ankle, she took me to the nurse. The nurse hit my leg, said, mm, can you feel da, da, da. At that time, my leg was starting to get swollen. Guys, I felt so sad. I felt like someone had broken my heart. It was like someone had broken my heart because my leg. How will I run again? The rest of the combat experience, I still had a problem with my leg. But as the days went by, my leg was getting better because... She gave me this ice pack, she gave me paracetamol, they gave me some medicine to put on my leg and they gave me this thing that I wrap around, it was a bandage that you wrap around your leg and just clip it, so yeah. They gave me all those things and they said if anything I should come back, she should bring me back, Sarah should bring me back and yeah. So then Sarah took me back to the barn where we have our meetings and the auditorium basically. Oh did I tell you guys, I actually got crutches. Like, I had to walk on crutches. They said by force, by force. I don't want to use that. They were so hard to use, guys. It was so tiring. Like, taking two steps is so difficult with the crutches. Like, so every once in a while, I'll try to move the crutches and try and walk on my own. But then, hey. But yeah, that's about my sprained ankle. I forgot to say this, but please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me. And thank you so much for the support. See ya.